okay? When the guy throws the punch, or it could be his right leg forward, right leg forward, and he's jabbing with the right hand, okay? So the main thing is when you're checking it, and once you're checking it, if you get that right hand to shoot up, once you check in, then that's where you work it. Now, your flashing mace, you're gonna hammer him across the face, but once you hammer, you turn. These are all one move. So all I'm doing is I'm stepping forward and pivot. So I kind of end up facing 4 o'clock, 4.30. Okay? When you step up, don't step up too close. Then you want to crowd yourself. In that case, we got to go to a short-range weapon and catch him with the elbow, which is nothing wrong with that. Okay? So you don't want to be focusing on this move, trying to get that in. Okay, because we got to be safe to begin with, working the block here. So if he's doing that and we drop him, and then I could catch it, catch it, get a hammer through, turn, that's all one move, and come up with the same amount of speed and power. If this leg is stepping up here, you feel tight on top, losing balance. So you got to step across. So once we catch and we hammer, I step where I could turn and I have the room. Nice strong stance, the forward bow. Then we tap on it twice, hit. So we hit it once, then check and bring it down. Now with that closed knee, catch him with the looping right here. Okay, now when I turn, I have two options. Either I gotta hit low, okay, and I come up with the left hand, or hit high, okay. We go high when we work the ending of the technique, okay. You go. So when I turn here, check, check up. See which way I send his face, looking that way. So when I turn, I turn here, taking the leg. And as I shoot him with the heel pump, this hits across. See that going here, and then I take the back leg going up the circle, boom, and take down. Watch it from this angle. That way we could work the ending also, so you can see the different approach. Because you guys are used to seeing from up here turning into a cat where the elbow and the forearm and the back fist shoots strong as we check and then we'll shoot on top. We've done it this way. So now, let's take the catch here, turn. So now from here, when you check and hit up, I'm gonna spin, but when you spin, it's gotta be strong. Because I'm spinning, see? With all the power, your mindset has got to be proper, okay? So, from here, when I spin, at the same time that I'm taking that leg, this is hitting up here, and this one, boom, catching down low. So it's all right here, and then as soon as you do this, you go up the surface and take him the other way. Do you see the timing here? Okay. I feel if you stretch, like you said, you just can stretch. So again, we catch the right, hit, hit, turn, up, I turn this way, up, and then I turn up the circle the other way. So it's one, two. You guys see the timing? Yes, sir. Okay. Let's go and work on that. Have fun. Any questions, let me know. Peace.